up guys, it's Rush here. Welcome back to Factions, ladies and gentlemen. I really do appreciate you tuning into this show every single day at 10 p.m. Eastern. Puts a big fat smile on my face. The support on the few or the last few episodes has been insane. This show is climbing. Once again, you guys are going absolutely crazy. Again, I don't tell you enough. I seriously don't. You're the best viewers in the world. I love you so much. Thank you for supporting what I love to do. Let's play some freaking factions. Daily factions comment of the day. Coming in from my boy, the legend, Spoon Fork. It's been a while. How to Minecraft was great. And yes, I am going to talk about this. At first, I was doubtful. The fans of HTM are known to be a tad bit salty. You know, if someone kills your favorite YouTuber, you go dislike their videos. That's actually happened a few times in the, in the QBHC as well. People get passionate. And I understand passion. I, I try and... You know, stay away from hurting other people's, you know, YouTube careers based on that. But, you know, alright, alright. But I actually liked the live stream. I can't wait for some fights to break out. It's awesome how you're branching out to other fan bases and giving them some love. I see a 1 million subscriber plaque in your future. <laughs> oh, man, I read this comment and it, it just, I mean, you, I don't know if many of you know. 1 million subscribers on YouTube. If I had any other goal in the world, that would probably be number one. Like, something I am just striving for. You know, it, it's a long run. It's a long goal. You know, we're at, what, 650,000 almost, which is an amazing number. I'm so thankful. But just to hear people say that and, you know, to give this new series a chance. And uh, I think a lot of you understand. Uh, if you missed it, by the way, it came out last night. Uh, Tuesday night, it would have been. Uh, I live stream the show and then I post it to YouTube, so it's a cool little mix. Um, but it just, uh, just you guys giving that sort of new series a chance, and I, I really think it's gonna develop into something that you and you and I can both love. It's just, it's so custom and so cool, but it's not modded. You know, it's plugins, which makes it epic and puts it really close to factions. So it, it's absolutely amazing, and just having your support for something. And having Spoon Fork, my boy, and lots of others tell me, you know, one day we're going to hit a million. It just brings a smile to my face. Thank you so much. Today we've got a cool day planned for you. I'm going to discuss two things before we get going. Not really discuss them, kind of go show things off. One thing was, we got raided by, or insided by Verdict X on an alt account. And, you know, he, he was bribed $100 USD real life money to do it. And what I didn't even think about it, but where the heck is the Ender or is the Dragon Egg? The Ender Dragon Egg. I I didn't even think of that. I saw a few of you comment. I'm like, oh my god. I didn't even ask Napkin. No one mentioned it. So we're gonna get a call with Napkin later today and figure out where the heck that thing is. He probably doesn't even know for the love of God. So we gotta find out. We lost the nameless name, and I oh I didn't even think about the Ender Dragon Egg. So that is a big worry of mine. And then also the new base, which we're going to touch on shortly. So lots of different cool things today. And you guys know last episode was filled with ups and downs emotionally. In the end, Napkin went Hulk mode and we took on a huge, rich raid. We got a ton of cool stuff here. We're going to sort through it, plan some stuff out. And this episode really is getting back on our feet. We need to turn things around, feel good about ourselves, and have a good time. So thanks for being here. You're all beautiful. Let's, uh, let's get to today's factions. Wild, I got you in a call here because I'm here looking at the the good old old base, uh, the base we used to have before Verdict X took it down and blatantly betrayed us and wrecked us, even when he was banned on the Archon. So this base is now gone, and I was just mentioning to the viewers and thinking back, we never talked about what the heck happened to the Dragon Egg. Did, like, did they get it? I, I assume they got the yeah. dragon egg. No, they actually didn't get the dragon egg. They didn't get the dragon egg. Now, how how did that happen? So, uh, basically what happened, before, like, Vertex incited, like, the whole base, yep. um, he blew up one of the members, or one of the mods boxes, Clemsy's box. Yeah, a couple hours before, right? Yeah. Or like a day before, like a couple hours, something like like twelve hours. A maybe, day or like a that. couple hours, one of the two. All right, yeah, all right. Who knows? All right. Um, but yeah, that happened, and then Napkin was like, "Oh, okay, I'm gonna take down the Dragon Egg because this guy's a little sketchy." 
And then, uh, yeah. And then I was like, let's demod Vert. And then... Well, demod the... Said, you mean demod the, uh... The alt account, not Vert. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. the alt account. Yeah, Demod yeah. the alt account. So basically, yeah, so you're saying, you know, Quemzy had this box, and a few hours before the event, Quemzy TP'd in the alt, and I don't know, like, did we know it was Vert at the time, or did we not know? Not really. We were kind of debating kind of thing. Yeah, we didn't really know. We so, kind of thought so, the account might have gotten hacked, too. Yeah, so we didn't really, you know, I mean, I don't know how, again, I was in, in school. This was early morning. I may have probably been sleeping, to be honest. And, you know, this guy TPs into Quemzy's box, or Quemzy TPs him in, because it's the alt account, the trusted alt account that, that shared all, within the faction. Not anymore, of course. But, and then he, he blows up the thing. He blows up the base. So what happened from there is he needed to be demodded, right? The, this uh, this alt needed to be demodded because it was sketching it out. The alt said, or I guess Vert at the time said, um, you know, just fooling around, not, not doing anything. I mean, I don't know how you could fool around and blow up a box. So basically from there, you guys wanted to demod, but I had admin of the faction at the time. And before I was home from school, because you guys know I missed it, a... Uh, a few by a few hours at least because I had class um, he had already done everything but napkin took out the dragon egg in a uh, preparation a uh, precaution basically right yep saved the freaking dragon egg because yeah when I read those comments I'm like oh my I didn't even think of that man what am I doing and yeah, so thank God. Napkin has the dragon egg in his e-chest, guys. It's uh, it's kind of weird. I, I don't know. It kind of doesn't even make sense to me. But because I wasn't online, I couldn't demod the guy. But also, you guys didn't seem too worried at the same time. You kind of thought it wasn't a huge deal. Maybe just a little fight within the faction or something. That's kind of how I'm perceiving the whole situation. Yeah, it was a little bit of a fight. And then... Uh... Yeah, now we're here. Now, now we we're here, dude. Lives. Great explanation, dude. Wild always gets into the, the good details of everything, the concrete oh, you want me to give details? No, nah, no, nah, we're good, man. Oh, okay, we're good. That's okay. a good explanation. So, yeah, <laughs> all in all, we have the dragon egg. It's safe. Thank freaking God. As I'm getting spam messages, Rush, where's the dragon egg? <laughs> but there it is. Thank, uh, thank God for Napkin's precaution. We still have one of the two dragon eggs on the server. Dun, 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 dun. Why am I singing Star Wars, you ask? Because it's my favorite series of all time. And the brand new movie premieres December 17th? I love how I say it's my favorite movie and then I don't know. It's 18th or 17th. You, probably, you guys probably know it's debatably one of the most hyped up movies of all time. And I love Star Wars. But I'm now going to reveal you the new base. Be careful. It's super epic. It's super insane. Watch out. The brand new base. <laughs> wow. That is <laughs> elegant, eh? Like it? Wow, man. Absolutely phenomenal. Let's get and fly here so we can take it all in. Ooh. Oof. Oh, that goes down a bunch more. There's like boxes in this one as well. Oh, there's boxes. The We're doing the box strategy again. So, oh yeah. Here it is. This is our our new base. I uh, the exterior is still being worked on. We've got lots of walls. That's really all that's being worked on. Everyone's going hard at the exterior. Napkins AFK. Why is he even AFK? We don't even have spawners. I think he's just you know chilling. Maybe he looks, he's getting something to eat. Who knows? He looks sad too. Look at him. Yeah, he's like he misses down. the old base, man. Kick him from the faction and kill him. Uh, no, but he, uh, oh, man. You guys, I was telling you guys last episode, that's one of the worst parts for me. When we get raided, it's like, I don't know. Do you feel, like, I just feel so bad for Napkin, dude. Because he, you know, it's like his baby. It is. It's like his, his own kin, man. But either way, this new base is up. And kind of just to give you a short or a, a small idea of what we got out of the the previous base we got some enchants out you guys know from the raid we got we got a bunch of enchants we got lots of armor as well lots of officer tnt you guys know we lost about half of our tnt unfortunately still lots left lots to raid with i mean again looking at the positives we're gonna get through it etc we're okay this is the brand new base in the making not even a different style i think uh napkin didn't even think twice hey eh? he's like all right base is down same hour we put up the same type of base we're in the end again as well right 
Oh yeah, we're like not against world border corner or anything. We're just right in the middle for Oh, walls. oh, so we've got a different type of base. This is yeah. one of the first times we've ever not been on a border, ladies and gents. So I'll I'll show you guys that the outside, uh, maybe next episode, hopefully. By the way, the uh, the new thing that was supposed to come out this weekend again, it's been up for testing on Factions Black, I think. And there's two more fixes that Jason has to put in. And uh, he's just got a family event that's uh, delaying it a little bit. They should be, it should be ready for Thursday. So hopefully, I really want to get that incorporated the Archon. A brand new update that will spice up the factions economy and how things work. It's going to be super, super exciting. And it's the start of December as well. So much stuff is on the way, Wild. And you know it, dude. So many <laughs> cool things and surprises for you beautiful people on the channel and on the server. So pvp.thearchon.net. Make sure you come and play. Jumping into kind of a weird call here for a big, big trade. I've got my buddy, I don't know free or L don't know free. I, I don't even know how to say that name. But it's one of those guys, this guy does not have a mic. He, he's got the headphones though. He's in the TeamSpeak call with me. And he's just he's just listening in and is going to reply via message. So what we're doing today, I, I kind of sent a message out in chat like, Hey, I'm in need of a bunch of XP bottles. You know, our, our spawners aren't set up. I need XP. I want to do a big mass bulk trade of XP bottles. A couple people piped up, you know, 10, 5 stacks. And then this guy comes up and he's like, Yo, I got, I got 20 plus stacks. And I'm like, Holy Lord, settle down. I'm going with you. So we got him in the team speak. He's listening. How you doing today? Uh, don't know Frio. Good. Oh, with capital letters as well. Wow, you must be doing really good. So my basically, you got 20 stacks. We we settled on 20 stacks. We've talked a little bit before, and now we're gonna try and negotiate out a price. Okay. And I am. I don't know, man. What what am I thinking here? I mean, I just lost a lot of money, so maybe I will do. Uh, I'm gonna say 100k. No freaking way. <laughs> what is with the caps? Are you serious? 100. What did I just say? 100k? He's shaking his head. How much do you want then? I mean, it's 20 sacks of XP. If my if my spawners were set up, I could I could get this on my own. But uh, of course, I 350k at least. Oh, my man, that is a little much. Are you serious? I don't. Do I even have 350k? Slash bow, okay, uh, alright, I, I do have it, but no way in heck I'm not paying that kind of money. I, I will go up to a maximum of 150k. Nope, you're just not going with it. This guy doesn't even want to negotiate. Jeez, man, I thought we'd have a little bit of negotiation skills, dude. I mean, I'll be honest, I'm not chicken, dude. Like, I will... I will do these things, I, I will negotiate, and I will, be, I will be honorable and honest with the people I make deals with, but you're asking way too much, man, and because of that, you've come to the wrong place, dude. <laughs> go, boys! Go. <laughs> go, boys! I go. just got kicked for flying. Rumble, no! Because I was stuck in sand. <laughs> Kev Shady, go, baby, go! Don't, he's in combat, he's in combat. You got pearls? Nah, dude. Alright, alright. I don't have a... Uh... Oh, my speed's not activated. Where's my speed? Go at him, Kev. Go at him, Kev. There we go. All right, gotcha, boy. I'll be there in a sec. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I So I talked to this guy a little bit before everything went down, and I could take good job. Good combat hit. I knew. I knew he was going to be a tough cookie to crack, so I put a couple backup plans into action, and we're pulling off one, well, I guess the first scam. Be careful here. Be careful here. Don't fall. Don't fall. One of the first scams oh of this gosh. season. Rumble, when you get back on, come back. Uh, Rumble, welcome back to the show, baby. Hey, what's <gasps> up? Nice try, I'm buddy. Here. I'm right nice behind you, by the way. Okay, nice close. try. I have him, I have him, I have him. Oh, nice try, baby. Nice try, baby. Oh, what is this guy? This guy's got the internet, man. This guy's got the internet <laughs> on his yeah, side. He's got his. He's got a few health pots on him, too. Knock him into that ravine. How is he does not he going jelly in? Legs? I don't you know if he has. Jelly legs, legs test! Done, Okay, good, good. He's in the ravine. He's screwed. He's got a. Uh, he's got bump or retreat three. One of the two. Oh, that he's... bounced him up. <laughs> I know you. I'm sorry about this. I'm sorry about this, Frio. Don't let him place blocks. Thunder strike. Thunder strike. Twenty two percent. Twenty percent. Give me those XP bottles, dude. You don't want to negotiate a fair price. Oh. Then we're gonna play. He's done, Zay, dude. Then we're gonna play. Play. Uh, play my way, my friend. Come on, bow shot hit. Come on, bow shot hit. 
Kev Shady. Kev Shady. Finish him, boys. Dude, this guy can juke, though. Oh, my God. He can juke. <laughs> Holy Lord. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. 8%. Don't give me it. Give me that. Oh, 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 oh. He actually had the bottom. Loot, 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 loot quick. Loot quick. Oh, my God. We can't pick him up yet till oh my god, the oh my time god, comes Oh my god, off. he had an unbreakable wait, 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 chest plate. Wait. He had an unbreakable chest plate. No Oh my god. Oh, we can pick it up now, okay. He had commander, too. Lucky he had commander uh, pieces of gear. Oh, here's some. Get the XP, get the XP. Oh my lord, dude. An unbreakable chest plate! Let's go, baby! Let's go! Nice. Prop 5, unbreakable. Oh my lord, dude. There's only a few of these that exist on Factions Gold right now, I think. It's one out of a crakey. Are you serious? That was on his god set? That's I got crazy. I got some bump three, scoot three, leaf three, dude. I'm feeling good. Did you guys get any other pieces of gear? He had um, um oh the bump nah, three. Nah, dude, I didn't get anything. Oh, didn't... I got I got diamond chest uh diamond leggings with weary three, toughness three, and replenish three. Oh, that replenish. What is that good? Yes, that's good. That's like the top big chat in the on. game. Oh my god. Oh, I get regeneration too. That was nice. a big scam, boys. Okay, I'm... Oh, he's ticked. I'm kind of glad this guy doesn't have a mic right now, just because... Um, all right, he's death banned, so you can't really reply. Um, Fronio or whatever it is. I'm sorry, man, but you were asking for way too much. And with the power of Team Nameless, we're not going to get bullied around. Oh, he's, he's saying WTF and he's poking me on TS. I'm sorry, man. You're asking way too much. And I took matters into my own hands. Ladies and gentlemen, the first scam of this season. And oh my god, it was a rich one. Rumble, man. I mean, that was... Okay, so yeah, we scammed the guy. I, uh, I talked to him before <laughs> and I had... Uh, like, I was kind of trying to work out a general price before we went into negotiating in the, in the clip. And this guy was just... He was starting to tick me off. He, he wasn't <laughs> doing a fair price in my mind. And again, I am one to be lenient sometimes. But... Not that lenient. So, took matters in my own hands. I set up the, the meeting area, and Rumble and Kevy G were prepped to take him out. Rumble, you make your reappearance into the show. You've been gone for Thanksgiving break, and that's how you make it back. You you scam a, a person and take, <laughs> and take his unbreakable chest plate. That's OP, oh, no, man. Bad. Oh, you should, dude. That guy worked hard for it, and you took <laughs> it from him. But... It was for Team Nameless, and Team Nameless is priority number one. Now, Rumble, while you were gone, we actually got raided, and this is our mm -hmm. new base. Well, the new base is up there. We, this is our box. This is your, mine, Mav, oh Mitch, Dolphin's box. And, yeah, we got, like, the leaky roof. I, uh, I think we got, <laughs> I think we, we know our position in the faction, you know? We got the leaky roof. It's dripping everywhere. But, no, it's cool. So, the new base is already being prepped. We've got defenses on it, etc. And, yeah, I've, I've put some of our stuff in chests here. Now, here's how I want to play it. Because if I look at my inventory, and you've got those pants now. You hang on to those. Replenish 3, you're OP. I don't even have Replenish 3 right now. But, um, basically, I'm rebuilding my god set. Because while we, you were gone, also, we lost a 5v5 for $10 million, which made me lose my god set. Oh so, I'm... Sort Gosh. of rebuilding and readjusting. With that in mind, I've got, uh, like, I actually could probably give you this helmet, to be honest. Uh, I don't know if I want to do it yet, because what do you have god set-wise? Just the pants now? I just have the pants. Oh, just the pants. This isn't even god set. It's just enchanted. It's just, uh, yeah, yeah, but that's a, no, that's a good piece of pants, though. That That's a good yeah. set. Use those pants for your god set is what I'm saying. <laughs> so I've got some stuff in here we can use. Now we've got the XP, we can roll some enchants. Um, so what am I looking for? Because I need, um, so I want to put some stuff on this chest plate, first of all. So I don't know, like, obviously that, the boots are good. Bump 3, Weary 3, Anti-Fog 1 is fine. And Replenish 3 would then need to go on the Unbreakable chest plate. Along with, uh, these ones here, Implode and Tipsy. Because if someone kills me, I don't want them getting it. So let's put that on. Implode... And I'm just planning out my, my set here. And you can take a few of these if you want to, if you want to put it on a... Can I take Retreat 3? Yeah. Uh, yes, I have Retreat 3, I believe, already. Okay, I need that because I don't have that. Online. Okay, yeah, I don't... Uh, yeah, you take that Retreat 3. I will get it later. Tipsy 3. I already have Weary 3. That's a good one. Vanish 3 is pretty good as well. 
Um, I don't know if it, it's just tough to do. I think it's a debate between Annie Fog or Vanish Three. What Napkin, does anti Fog do? Annie, yeah, Napkin, are you there? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's there. He's getting a phone call. <laughs> <laughs> As soon as I ask me, he gets a phone call. All right, never mind. Yeah, because I'm. We've got Vanish three or Annie Fog one. Oh, it's so tough. I'm gonna go with Vanish three, and I'm gonna start enchanting this chest plate for you guys. I think I put it in my e chest. Yes, I did. Oh, this is so op, so so good. Um, so let's hit ourselves with some XP here. We got a lot of stacks from that rumble. Oh baby, we got a lot. And let's do let's do this. So I definitely want. Definitely want implode three and then I definitely want to save room for replenish and let's go with vanish as well Van vanish or retreat dude. What what should I do vanish or retreat? Um, Retreat retreat. Do you know what retreat does that makes you get away right No, vanish that oh, gets you speed too, right? No, 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 you're thinking uh, scoot dude. Look at you look at this noob dude He doesn't even know what he's oh, saying. Oh shit. What? It should have been called Retreat, the speed one. That ain't bad, yeah, that ain't bad. Scoot, though, dude. Like, I'm scooting through them all, you know? <laughs> I just used it in a sentence for you, like a spelling bee. All right, oh, got that. Scoot, and actually, I just forgot with the Prop 5 chest plate, because it only has one enchant on it, I can actually put four enchants on it. So never mind. I don't even need to decide. Why am I freaking out so much? I don't even need to decide. Um, so that'll do that. Let's go spin an enchant, my man. Let's uh, let's spin some tier threes. All right, buddy. I'm gonna save this e chest yeah. for the time being, and let's get to level 45 and spin some enchants, my man. All complete, dude. Split between. I think it's about five e or five stacks for level 45. So we've already used about half of them, unfortunately. But worth it. Saves us some time, and we don't really have the spawners right now. All right, Rama, you ready for a spin? 45 levels, yes. Spin once and go. Go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Give oh, me I got something. Oh, wait. It says. Ah, experience three. I got toughness three. Oh, that, that's all right. That's not bad. Dang it, man. I want replenish three, man. Ugh. Okay. I wouldn't mind health boost <laughs> or replenish. replenish. You got replenish? Well, it's in my pants. Okay. Okay. Let me spin. I'm going to spin one more uh, tier two to try and land health boost because I do need to replace this helmet and then I can give this helmet to you potentially. Um,. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it that way. I'm gonna set my set home FF here. Let's get up to level 30 and try again, dude. Uh, experience three just ain't gonna cut it. It's good, but I think we've already got like two of them. So back to level 30. Level 30, spin once, jump, hit it. Ugh, I missed. <laughs> life to God, I already have that. Wait, is, isn't life a health boost? <sighs> no, that's health boost, dude. Life two steals. No, it doesn't steal. I think it just gives you life. Uh, Sometimes when you hit them with the sword a small percent That's all right. It, no, it's not bad. It's not bad. Actually. I'll give this I'll put it in our uh, our home back here All right, and I will you can use it for your your sword. I just already have Ooh. it on my god sword So all right, we'll take it not bad. I'm pumped out of my mind though because that very mean scam Oh, excuse me towards that evil individual that unfair individual. I made it more unfair for him and we got an unbreakable chest plate. That's so OP. The best chest plate, honestly, the best piece of gear that you can get on on the Archon. So absolutely amazing. That gets me psyched. And Rumble, it also gets me psyched that you're back. I miss you so much, and I hope Aww. I hope your relationship Ooh. is still strong. <laughs> we will talk more about that in a different video, dude. I want to hear all the details, marriage dates, oh, being your best man, what what color suit do I wear? <laughs> That kind of stuff. With that being said, I hope you all enjoyed today's episode of Factions. If you did, touch that like button. Join the rush by subscribing and make sure to share this show just with one friend. One, one friend. And recent five donators of the Archon, we got XX Ramble, Legion243, Franchise Gaming, Retro PvP, and X Mr. Sour Skittles X. Thank you for purchasing the Archon. You need Cray Key time? Go big or go home, Brain. Come on. Unique, Come on. Okay. Let's go. Unique. Top five leather armor. Mine's spinning right now. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Dang, dude. It's like, ugh. Yeah. I feel like I'm ready to freak out, and then it's just like, ugh, and then I have to just go back into my chair and cry myself to sleep. Prop five leather armor. Oh, did you hear? Oh, what? I think somebody on silver won the Goliath. Yes, I actually did hear that. Faction silver. Someone 64 won. 64 obsidian. What'd you got? 64 obsidian. That's better than mine. Someone on silver won the Goliath rank, and I think that makes two in all on the Archon who have won it. 
Silver, uh, apparently that guy just runs chat now. He says something, everyone's like, everyone hails him. So congrats <laughs> to that guy, man. That is absolutely huge, winning the Archon Crate Key jackpot. Very proud of you, young sir, and hopefully we can meet this guy and talk to him soon. So there it is, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we'll talk to you all later. Hope you have a beautiful day. Goodbye.